بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از سائرا اجمل اینڈ آئی ایم فرام بی ایس پی ٹی دس از دا سیکنڈ پارٹ آف مائی پریزنٹیشن ٹاپک سائیکالوجی اینڈ کیمسٹری ان دا فرسٹ پارٹ آئی ہیو ایکسپلین اباؤٹ ڈیز آرڈرس دیٹ آر ریلیٹڈ ٹو کیمسٹری اینڈ سائیکالوجی اینڈ ان دس پارٹ آئی ول ایکسپلین اباؤٹ ڈرگس اینڈ دا ٹریٹمنٹ آف دیٹ ڈیز آرڈر ڈرگس There are several different types of drugs available to treat mental illness. Some of the most commonly used are antidepressant, anti-anxiety, antipsychotic, mood stabilizing and stimulant medications. Depression. Drugs are used to treat depression. When treating depression, several uh, drug options are available. Some of the most commonly used include selective serotonin, Selective serotonin uptake inhibitors. L-methylfolate. L-methylfolate has proven successful in treating depression. It is the active form of one of the B vitamins called folate and helps regulate the neurotransmitters that control mood. Although it is not technically a medication, it does require a prescription. Anxiety. Drugs treat anxiety disorders. Antidepressants, particularly SSRIs, may also be effective in treating many types of anxiety disorders. Other anti-anxiety medications include, uh, include the such as alprazolam, dizepam, and lorazepam. These drugs carry a risk of addiction, so they are not as described for long-term use. Other possible side effects include drowsiness, poor concentration, and irritability. Drug Bospirone Busper The drug Bospirone Busper is a unique drug that is non-habit-forming and often used to treat generalized anxiety disorders. Alzheimer Disorder What is Alzheimer's disorder? Alzheimer's disorder is an irreversible progressive brain disorder that slowly destroys memory and thinking skills and eventually the ability to carry out the simplest tasks in most people with the disease those with the late onset type. Symptoms first appear in their midst. There are seven stages of Alzheimer's disease. First stage before symptoms appear, basic forgetfulness, noticeability, memory difficulties, more than memory loss, decreased independence, severe symptom, lack of physical control. Drugs used for treatment. There are two different types of drugs that are used in the treatment. Cholinesterase inhibitors, these drugs work by boosting levels of cell-to-cell -cell communication by preserving a chemical messenger that is deple depleted in the brain by Alzheimer's disease. These are usually the first medication tried and most people see modest improvements in the symptoms. The main side effect of these drugs include diarrhea, nausea, loss of appetite, the sleep disturbance in people with certain heart disorders. Serious side effects may include cardiac arrhythmia. Mimantin, uh, this drug works in other brain cell communication network and slows the progression of symptoms with moderate to severe Alzheimer's disease. It's sometimes used in combination with a cholinesterase inhibitor. Relatively rare side effects include dizziness and confusion. Parkinson's disease. Drugs used for treatment. Car Carpitova, Leodopa. Leodopa, the most effective Parkinson's disease medication, is a natural chemical that passes into your brain and it is converted to dopamine. Leodopa is combined with carbidopa, which protects liver dopa from early conservation to dopamine outside by your brain. This prevents or lessens side effects such as nausea. Side effects may include nausea or light, uh, light headed sun. After years, as your disease progresses, the benefits from Leodopa may less, become less stable with other MC2 vaccine pain.
amantadine. Doctors may prescribe an uh, amantadine alone to provide short-term relief of symptoms of mild early stage Parkinson's disease. It uh, may also be an, given with car carbitova dopa leodopa uh, therapy during the later stages of Parkinson's disease to control involuntary movements induced by carpi dopa leodopa. Anticholinergics. These medications were used for many years to help control the tremor associated with Parkinson's disease. Several anticholinic uh, medications are available, including ben benzotropane or trihexyphenyl. Huntington. Huntington disease. What is Huntington disease? Huntington's disease is an inheritable disease that causes the progressive dying of or the denervation of nerve cells in certain parts of brain. How does hunger affect the brain? The most severe loss of nerve cells, called neurons, occur in deep brain structures that the basal ganglia, especially in a part of basal ganglia called Stratum. The basal ganglia have a variety of functions, including helping the control voluntary movements. Subsections of the basal ganglia, called the caudate nuclei and putamen, are most severely affected. Drugs are used for Huntington disease. Tetrabenzine, which causes depletion of the neurotransmitter dopamine, is prescribed for treating Huntington uh, associated involuntary movements as in benzene. Antipsychotic drugs. Antipsychotic drugs, however, typically do not help with the muscle contraction associated with dystonia. Involuntary muscle contraction that can cause low repetitive movement or abnormal postures and may in fact worsen the condition causing stiffness and rigidity. Drugs used to treat symptoms of HD may have side effects such as fatigue, sedation, decreased concentration, restlessness or hyper excitability and should be only used when symptoms create problem for individuals. For those on medication, it may be difficult to tell if a particular uh, symptom such as apathy or memory loss is a sign of disease or drug reaction. Schizophrenia. What is schizophrenia? It is a serious mental disorder in which people interrupt reality abnormally Schizophrenia may result in some combination of hallucinations, delusions, and extremely disordered thinking and behavior that impairs daily functioning and can be disabling. Some common medications uh, for schizophrenia include trusty sources, risperidone, olanzepine, quetiapine, uh, ziprasidone, clozapine. Haloperidol. That said, many of these drugs have adverse effects, including neurological symptoms and weight gain. Newer medications may have less severe side effects. Bipolar. What is bipolar disorder? Bipolar disorder, also known as manic depression, it is a mental illness that brings severe high and low mood changes in sleep energy thinking behavior people who have bipolar disorder can have periods in which they feel overly happy energized and other periods feeling very sad hope, hopeless and sluggish treatment involves the combination of therapies like medication counseling physical interventions lifestyle rem remedies drug treatment drug treatment can help stabilize mood and manage uh, symptoms a doctor will often prescribe a combination of mood stabilizers such as lithium antidepressant second generation antipsychotics anticonvulsants to relieve mania medications to help with sleep or anxiety valproic acid is a mood stabilizer that is helpful in treating the manic or mixed phases of bipolar disorder along with carbamazepine, 
These drugs may be used alone or in combination with lithium to control symptoms. In addition, neural drugs are coming into the picture when traditional medications are insufficient. Limotrigon and other anti epileptic drug has been shown to have value for preventing depression and to lesser degree manic other uh, anti epileptic drugs such as gabapentin or oxycarbazepine or or atapiramatin are regarded as experimental treatments that sometimes have value for symptoms of bipolar disorders or other conditions that often occur with it some of these drugs can potentially become toxic if does get too high therefore they need to be monitored periodically with blood tests and clinical assessments by a prescriber because it is often difficult to predict which patients will react to what drug or what the dose should ultimately be the psychiatrists will often need to experiment with several different medications when beginning treatment while the antidepressants remain widely prescribed for bipolar depression and most antidepressants have not been adequately studied in patients with bipolar depression this is all about my topic thank you so much